Hello and welcome to Marketing Launch Secrets. This is week one, training one. We're officially in training. Last week we went through onboarding and today we're getting into the nitty gritty. Now, if you remember in our session last week, I would have shared with you that we have a strategy, which is called the get it done strategy, where we take you out of inertia all the way into implementation. And today we're gonna to be taking a look at all of the groundwork the fundamental part of implementation is what I call the 21 day launch plan. I'm very grateful to one Rhonda Swan. When I first started on this journey, um, Rhonda had, I came across Rhonda's work in the, during the one funnel away challenge. And it really helped me to find a space and find my voice on, on Facebook, even though nobody was watching my videos. So this is kind of your introduction to the organic Facebook marketing method that uh, we spoke about. This is gonna be reinforced a little bit later in the program, but I want to start you here so you can see how all of the pieces come together for this. You're, I'm about to take you through uh, the 21 day launch plan, some of the communication parts, and also so you can start thinking about your themes and your posts. So all that information is gonna be in there for you. Then we're going to go through uh, the the next thing, which is the process, and the major process is the marketing launch formula. That's not likely to be covered in this video, it will be in the next video, and I don't wanna give you too much information. So right now, let's jump in to what we have immediately, which is the 21-day launch plan. And as we go through this, this file is available to you, it's yours, so you can use it in any way you so desire. If you're a little bit behind on your ideal client work, now is a great way to catch up so you have the foundation of all of the work you're going to need to launch in the next few weeks all right let's jump into it so i'm going to share my screen here and here we go all right cool so this is the marketing playbook and this is your success plan this is the core of the work that we're gonna be doing together. So one of my favorite quotes is from Stephen Covey who says that we're to begin with the end in mind. And a big part of the work we're doing now is exactly that, beginning with the end in mind. Just wanna make sure that everything's good here, yeah. All right, so how we first started beginning with the end in mind is doing the work with the ideal client worksheet and the customer avatar graphic. If you haven't done that work yet, you can just click on here, it becomes a clickable document, and it will open up for you so that you have access to it. Just in case um, you wanted to have an alternate approach to the ideal client document now, you'll notice that the, the way that I've kind of approached the ideal client is in the most simplified way possible, which is just by looking at three major aspects of your ideal client. But there is an alternate approach that you may want to take, and I'm going to just share that with you. It's also inside of this document, and it's called the Ideal Customer Avatar. It's a graphic that you can also use to help you get some more information. Um, on one of the coaching calls, uh, on one of the coaching calls um, this week, uh, it was really cool because uh, someone said to me, oh, Samantha, you know, I thought I was really cool and I, I understood what I wanted to do with my ideal client until I realized that maybe they couldn't pay me. And that comes from the document that I just shared with you, right? Having those three main areas, the person that you love to work with, the person who can impact the most, but also the person who can pay you. So between these two, you will have your customer avatar. Don't worry, we're going to come back and reinforce this in a little while. Then we're gonna go down and look at the communication cycles, your 21 day plan. Now, the 21 day plan is stackable. It first starts with your seven day stack, which is your building blocks. Three of the seven days go into a 21 day plan. And if you're going for a longer plan, like a, a 60 or a 90 day plan, you can use the same 21 day plan and stack it in the same way to create a much longer launch for yourself. So the first thing that you should have done here is gone to find your major theme. And we brainstormed that a little bit in our onboarding session um, and also in our very first uh, tutorial, right? And Q&A session. Find your major theme. So here I gave the example that if the title of my group 
or the title of my idea was Abundant Entrepreneurs, the essence of my major theme would be abundance, abundance for entrepreneurs or abundance for female entrepreneurs. And then I'd go from there and develop the idea a little bit more. After you have your main theme, you want to have three main topics. And from there, you want to find five subtopics. Now, I've created this worksheet just to make it a little bit easier for you to do this process. So once you click on the link inside of the document, the communication cycle worksheet is here. It allows you to put your three major themes. You can go through, and I actually do a few examples for you. Then it allows you to go through even further and identify three main topics. And I suggest that you start thinking about your ideal client pain points as the best way to put the topic. So I put some examples of pain points there. Then you can shortlist, right, the pain points for the three main topics. And I went ahead and gave you an example of that. And then we go into the subtopics. Now, this document is a view only, but if you make a copy for yourself, so you just make a copy and I'll show you how to do that. You can save this into your Google Drive and you can edit it for yourself so that you can start putting your information inside of here. Now, what I, will, what I have done is I've given you an example of some of the things that could go, the example that I've been using throughout this document. And once this is completed, you will use these as your daily post ideas in your 21 day plan, all right? So let me just show you quickly how to do this. And we, we, can, we can do it because well, you'll have quite a few files that you want to do like this. You're going to go into your document that's open, your Google Doc, and you are going to press file, then put make a copy because this is a view only version. And when you make a copy, um, you can make a copy and put it into your drive. Alternately, you can uh, also, uh, yeah, make a copy is the best way to do this, actually, make a copy. So you go in, it's going to be view only, you make a copy, or you can go about doing a save as, and then save a version for yourself. All right, good. So that is the worksheet. Let's jump back into here. All right, so the 21-day plan, like I mentioned earlier, consists of seven-day building blocks. During each of the seven-day periods, you're going to use one of the top five recommended post ideas, which I've also included inside of here for you. So you've got swipe files, you've got examples, um, and you've also got links to the actual posts that I've used in the past. And there's a huge revelation here. As I went through this material from October of last year, and uh, in October was when I was really getting into the groove of doing the posts. And it was just before I launched Marketing Launch Secrets Round 3, got 25 people, had one of my best 48-hour sales yet. I made over uh, $5,000 in 48 hours, which for me is a huge deal because I hadn't made very much money online before, especially not with my own course. And I noticed that, you know, usually they say to you, you need to have a Facebook group with over 500 people to start making money. My Facebook group did not even have 350 people in it. They always say to you, oh, you want to make sure that you have high engagement, high engagement. When you look at these posts, a lot of them don't even have 30 likes on them. But they started the trajectory of me attracting the ideal client that I had at the time to come and join the program. So I just want you to know, you don't have to worry. If you don't, if you, no one seems to be watching your lives or you don't seem to have a ton load of engagement on your posts, don't worry, just keep going and stick with the plan. All right, so the seven day launch plan, the first building block is the first seven days. And in another program, if you're interested, we can go through the power of just seven days of consistency online through the organic Facebook marketing method. For right now, I just want you to know, this is what you're going to do. You're gonna go live a minimum of once a day, Monday to Friday, and uh, you will share the stories or the subtopics based on what we discussed earlier. And then once you have the building block, it's time for you to map out the 21 day plan. So I've gone ahead and created for you the 21 day launch planning guide timeline. So that way you can always be aware of where you are in the program, but also where you are in preparation for your 21 day launch plan. Because the 21 day launch plan is what's gonna get your course filled. It's what's gonna get you to your goals. So our program, our Marketing Launch Secrets program, actually runs you about 40 days. We have our onboarding week, we're gonna have some time of training inside of here. 
And then we're also gonna go into implementation. So when we started, we were about 40 days out, we started shortlisting product ideas, you completed your launch statement, you started thinking about the main themes, and you should have had your clarity coaching session with me. If you haven't yet had it, you need to make sure that you have it. Because that's where we're going to be able to find you, find who you are, connect all of your varied interests to develop this course, this idea, this program, this launch, which is going to bring you in more money, more interest, more engagement, more impact than ever. Then 30 days out, which is around where we are now, you want to develop your marketing launch formula, which we're going to go into. You want to complete your offer, which is part of what we're going to go into as part of the marketing launch formula. You want to create a draft of your complete 21 day plan. And that's where we're focused right now. And I actually want you to, to stay there because this is going to keep you in ideation. So I'm actually going to move this down a little bit. I'm going to move this down a little bit. So by the time you get it, you'll see it just like this. So you're gonna create a draft of your 21 day launch plan, your complete draft in your written posts, develop your marketing launch plan, which we'll go into, we'll go into the offer, we'll start the branding in Canva. We're also, if you're interested, we also recommend that you create a messenger bot sequence because this is going to help you just to automate things and that is optional, that is completely optional, but I'll uh, walk you through that in one of our tutorial sessions. If you're gonna have print material, you wanna start getting print material in motion and you wanna begin the content creation process, which is the top five posts for Facebook, which I already shared with you um, earlier and they are in the main document. So as you go through this, you're gonna see the timeline. It takes you all the way down to what you should do for launch day. But right now, here is where you wanna be focused. We're about 30 days out from your actual launch. So all of this is part of the launch planning, okay? So you're about 30 days out, that's where we are right now. That's where you wanna focus on the 30 days out period. All right, cool. So we've got that. This document is chock filled with resources for you. All right, now within 14 to 21 days of starting your launch campaign, you wanna launch your event. Now that event is gonna be a masterclass, a VIP day. It may be you going straight to the sale. And I put a note here that um, Wednesdays at 11 a.m. have been statistically shown to be the best time for webinars, trainings, um, but you can check the stats for yourself depending on what, when you're doing it. But if you're doing a webinar and you're going live with that, Wednesday at 11 a.m. has been statistically proven as the best time to do a training. Now, here is another special note for you. There, here are some post swipe files. So I'm giving you an example of the top performing post that I had on my page in October 2019, just so that you can see, you know, like I said, my aha, my aha moment, aha, you know, Angel started singing for me, is that many of these posts don't have engagement over 30 likes or responses or noteworthy response weights, but they got people to sign up for my program and my program was oversubscribed. If I can do it, you can do it too. You don't need a huge following to get your course filled. You just need to be consistent with your message to your ideal client. And the 21 day plan is what helps you to do that. So the top five recommended posts are here. Guys, listen, I've been, I've done several programs. I'm still in several of them. Some people say there were 11 posts. There are 20, there are 21, posts. a ton of them. I was overwhelmed. I knew I couldn't focus on 20, but I could focus on five. I identified the five that I thought would work best for me and they did work. And so I'm recommending them for you. Big tip here, be as vulnerable as you can in your post and it's gonna connect with your ideal customer in a powerful way. Now, then I share with you a tip. Now, this tip comes from Andrew Cruz, who is one of my mentors and coaches right now. And he has found this kind of formula that works. If you wanna grow your personal page, you wanna fill out your course, you wanna do it organically, here are the things to do. Adding 50 new Facebook friends a day. Now, you know what? I didn't do this, guys, because I found it very overwhelming. Some days I didn't even um, add 10. And I, I can tell you, I haven't been consistent in adding five or 10 a day. You know, I'm probably averaging maybe about three to five people a day right now. My point is that you can do even the minimum and get results. What do we always say? 
You want to have massive, imperfect action because that's what's going to get you into momentum and get you on in what you need. So we want to do CIA, which is consistent intentional action. We want to add that to massive imperfect action. It doesn't matter. You know, something is better than nothing, right? So if you add three people, it's better than adding zero people. Add them and get that work done. All right, so this is what's going to take us to the end of the marketing playbook, the success plan. This is where I want you to focus today, right? Don't you looking anywhere else, just focusing today. Because once you understand the framework of your 21-day launch plan, you can put your launch in place, you can set the date, get it in your calendar, and work backwards from there. We're about 30 days out from your actual launch, and everything we do from here on in is a part of the launch process. And together we're gonna to work through, you know, design and funnel creation and your sales message and the offer. And the marketing launch formula is gonna do that. Guess what? You're already in the midst of working on a lot of it. And the next training we do is gonna take you into the depth of the marketing launch formula. For now, here is what you've got. I hope you love it. I can't wait to hear your feedback, see how this document helps you get from where you are to where you want to be, which is an amazing launch, right? <laughs> okay, guys. So that document is going to be available for you. The link to this video is going to be available for you within the group, as well as the document that I just shared with you. Can't wait to see your successes. I'm all about it. And I can't wait to see you inside of the next training. Be sure to be at the live tutorial session, our next live tutorial session, where we'll cover your questions here and start prepping you with the marketing launch formula and the next step of your amazing launch. All right, I'm Samantha, and I can't wait to see you.